Del Seton Medical Center is now open to patients. Fox 7's Bridget Spencer was there this morning and has that story. Lillian maybe knew something wasn't right with her body last Wednesday. She got to a clinic as soon as possible. They took my temperature. It was up to 102.5. And they said, something's not right, dear. Lillian was transported to UMC Brackenridge, where she was treated for an infection. At the same time, she was also told she'd be moved to the brand new Dell Seton Medical Center across the street Sunday. This in the middle of her recovery. I have no problem with it. As a matter of fact, I'm looking forward to it. Perfect. It's a process that went smoothly on Sunday as Austin Travis County EMS moved more than 100 patients, including Lillian, to the new facility, which will replace Brackenridge. Secret patient goes first because we have enough time uh, to take care of any needs that they have. UMC Brackenridge is a legendary name, so the move is bittersweet, but medical staff deem it necessary. I'm providing a different, uh, a different care, not only um, because we're leaving this place, but all the technology that we have. As soon as the pa I come to the room, the patient will be able to see my picture in the TV, knowing who I am, what, I, what work do I do. More technological improvements include patient education material on screens and the latest equipment for doctors. They said that it's so much more spacious, and they said you would not believe how beautiful it is. I said, well, this, this hospital is beautiful. They said, but wait till you see the other. Technology changes, but one thing remains constant, the medical staff's intentions for all patients who will come through these doors. I'm homeless, so being indoors on a bed, a real bed, is very important to me. In downtown Austin, Bridget Spencer, Fox 7 News.